The doctor's company analyzed 542 medical malpractice claims against diagnostic radiologists that closed from 2013 to 2018. Diagnosis-related claims were the most common case type, and malignant neoplasm of the breast was the most common misdiagnosis. This case study illustrates this risk. A 49-year-old patient presented for a routine screening mammogram. The radiologist who read the mammogram noted that the study was not complete due to density of breast tissue and recommended additional studies. One week later, a second mammogram was performed. The second radiologist noted very dense tissue but no evidence of malignancy. No follow-up was recommended. One year later, the patient presented to her gynecologist with a complaint of a breast lump. The gynecologist ordered bilateral mammograms and right breast ultrasound. The radiologist advised follow-up studies in one year. The patient did not return for three years. The patient then presented to urgent care with severe back pain, shortness of breath, and chest pain. A biopsy showed metastatic breast carcinoma. The patient expired two years later. Plaintiff's experts opined that the original mammogram was abnormal enough to prompt an MRI and biopsy. The second year's mammogram was more suspicious of abnormality and included a complaint of a breast lump. They also stated that if diagnosed and treated in the first year, the cancer would not have metastasized. Radiologists should work with ordering physicians about next steps when study interpretations don't fit the clinical picture. Order repeat studies when views are not of good quality or positioning blocks the full view. Document all attempts to contact patients about missed follow-ups.